the Cleveland Museum of Art has some exceptional pieces from Monet to Marilyn. But one of the key attractions is a wing dedicated to Asian art. So we have here too um, a sculpture of the uh, dating to the 8th century. But a collection of this size and importance also represents a major conservation challenge given the fragile nature of the materials used to create them. Asian paintings and uh, paperwork needs a very specialized skill set. The uh, way of learning and training somebody for conservation of uh, Chinese paintings uh, is done in a master student uh, apprenticeship relationship is transformed from one hand into the other from the master who is experienced to the to the student and this takes a long long time time is not the only issue a number of masters have recently retired attracting the masters that are left to move from china to the u.s can be both difficult and costly there's now a shortage of masters to do the work we are using these strips uh, to reinforce the, the gap. But Yi Shai Shao hopes to be part of a new generation of conservators. Working in the recently established Center for Chinese Paintings Conservation at the museum, Shao is currently working under her fourth master. Apprenticeship programs can take more than a decade to pass. If you see the, um, the Kung Fu movie, then you know which is master. They, they wouldn't teach you to do the treatment right away. They make you to do a lot of uh, fundam fundamental uh, process. So you have to observe them. You have to like, learn by watching them and by you know, talking to them. There are only three other conservation programs like this one in the United States. Despite a lack of Asian art conservationists in the US, it is hoped that programs like this one can help establish a pathway and ensure the expertise continues to be passed down. You see this, um, this is beautiful. I will be a uh, master <laughs> and then uh, I will be trending uh, next generation. So it's a milestone for our museum. We have to attract um, younger generation to, uh, to make commitment on this field. In time, it's hoped this center will operate workshops and courses to expand the Asian art knowledge pool within the US and preserve treasures like these for generations to come. Dan Williams, CGTN, Cleveland, Ohio.